Hello, fans of the internet. My name is Starlos, and whew, what fucking day are we in? It is currently March 14th, and the February loot crate has finally come in. So we're going to open this motherfucker and see what's inside, because I've been waiting. How long? I thought someone stole it. I thought it was never going to come in, but it's in. So we're going to open it with a big knife. I've seen bigger knives when people do this, but I can't find my uh, Halo energy sword. I was going to use that to open it, but I don't know where it is because I don't prepare for things. All right, powered by Loot Crate. Yeah, I know. It's Loot Crate. Wow, we got a lot of stuff in here. All right, this is uh, Fragile. I'll show you the box later. All right, so we got a t-shirt here. We got Zelda Breath of the Wild. Wow, this is pretty dope. Uh, never played Zelda. Well, I played a couple of Zelda games, but this is the shirt. It's kind of thin. It's very fucking huge. Wow, that is huge. This is bigger than me. Um, that's the shirt. If you guys can see it, that's the shirt. So I will be putting that on later. You know, model it for you. We got a hat. That's a really big ass hat. That's a World of Warcraft hat. Wow, we got a lot of cool stuff up in here. Hey. This is my knife. Alright, let's open this up. I almost stabbed my finger there. I'll be honest with you. Alright, I need a... Close that. Make sure my dog's not barking. No, this has sound big. Alright, I thought it was big, but... Sorry. Um, it's a World of Warcraft hat. This is a lion thingy majiggy. It's, um... Hand wash, do not bleach, do not iron, do not dry or clean, do not double dry. Reversible beanie. Wow, it's reversible? Whoa! It's a red thing, and then it's a lion. Alright, so this is the lion. See that? Lion. And then it does a reversible thing. That's actually kind of cool. I've never seen a reversible beanie before. Or maybe I just don't get out a lot. And then it's like that thing. So we're going to wear it. I don't like that one, though. I mean, it looks cool, but... Yeah, alright. Uh. Alright, cool, I guess. This is pretty dope. Can't really see, but it's alright. I don't know where the thing is. I think it's right there. I have no idea. Alright, we'll wear that. I'm probably wearing this wrong. Hold up. Let me uh, find out where it is. Alright, it's right there, kind of. So it's right there. Alright. We got a canteen from Pitfall. I don't know what Pitfall is. So we got a lot of big things. Alright, let's see what this is. It's uh, metal. So that's nice, nice touch, nice touch. Alright. It's a nice canteen from Pitfall, so this is what it looks like. You guys can see that. Then on the back it says Pitfall, and it's a canteen. It's metal, or whatever, tin. Uh, it's plastic inside. Uh, twist the top here. And yeah, you can... Lovely. I look beautiful. Alright. Then we got the pin for February, and the theme for it is wild. So I will show you the pin right there. That is the pin. You guys can see that. It has like a little compass and a North Star, so that's going to go in my pin collection for Loot Crate. That, throw that over there. Um, got a husky with an eye patch. That's adorable. And it's a keychain. I don't really... I have a lot of keychains. But this is adorable. The face is kind of square. But, um, yeah. It's a little puppy. It has, like, a eye patch right there. And then it's a keychain. Put it on a, you know, key. It's actually kind of fluffy. Alright. Let's see. Letter. Thanks to support from looters like you, we've built Loot Crate from a small garage-based company to what it is today. We're celebrating our fifth anniversary this year with a new logo designed to look like a... 
to look like a window into the worlds, stories and characters we all love. Uniting all our crates under a single brand, we can't wait to build even more great memories with you. We love you, Chris and Matthew, co-founders of Loot Crate. So that is their new logo. I don't know what their old logo was. I don't give two shits. I'll just say that right now. All right, now we're gonna look at the poster. Oh, I see a bear. I see a teddy bear. It's not really a teddy bear. It's a bear that can rip off my face, but hey now, that's the poster. You guys can see that, all of it. I don't know, I'm gonna pan a little bit. That's the poster. All right, so the theme, wild. Experience out adventure as we trek through the great outdoors in this month's wild crate. Explore the wilderness with exclusive loot from Legend of Zelda, Breath of the Wind, World of Warcraft, Metal Gear Solid V, The Phantom Pain, and Pitfall. So, Pitfall, the canteen, which is right here. I will read you from that. In the classic Atari title Pitfall, players control Pitfall Harry and must get him through a maze-like jungle in an attempt to recover all 32 treasures within 20 minutes. Wow, that, that seems hard. Concerted to be the ancestor of all side-scrolling platforming genre, despite not being a side-scrolling game. Okay, <laughs> that doesn't make sense. The game was highly influential, and this year marks Pitfall's 35th anniversary in honor that the Jungle Journey we created a metal canteen with a carrying strap and you can take with you on your adventures. And it is compatible with most cold drinks. So, Metal Gear Solid V, The Phantom Pain Plush D-Dog. Uh, I'm not going to read every single one of them because that is a lot. So, the Nintendo Switch Epic Drop. Three lucky winners get the Nintendo Switch Epic Drop. And the World of Warcraft beanie and the t-shirt. So, I'm... Oh, whoa. Whoa there. I hit my stand. No. There we go. I'm not gonna touch it again. I don't know what I did. All right, so now comes the time where I fold this bad boy up into whatever. Oh my God, it's actually easy? What? All right, last time I spent so long trying to do that. All right, so while I am doing this, I would like to give a couple of shout outs to a couple people on the YouTube. I wanna shout out, uh, their links will be in the description down below. Uh, Scrawl? I don't know how to say your name, sorry, Kenny. But it's uh, my good friend Kenny from uh, school. Uh, he's doing Loot Crate now, so I'm gonna put that video link down below, and it'll probably be up here. I don't really know how to do annotations, but if it's not there, I don't, I don't know. Hey. Um, but he did start Loot Crate because I was doing it, and um, I thought it was really cool. <coughs> sorry. I was eating before this. Something got stuck in my throat. Um, so I thought it was cool that he was doing it. So I want to shout him out. He's a very good friend of mine. Uh, so yeah, link down below. I also want to shout out Emma Plays uh, for personal reasons. Uh, she did help me out with uh, my name, with uh, Starlos. Uh, she did give it back to me. So thank you all for that. So. I actually might do more shoutouts coming out, so if you guys actually want one, if you're a new channel starting out and you want to boost out a couple subscribers and all that, just be an active subscriber on my channel and I will uh, shout you out. Just comment, like, be subscribed, be active, and uh, here and there I'll shout people out. So Emma plays in Scrawl, if that's how you pronounce it, I have no idea. I should have looked at it before, but uh, this is the uh, Loot Crate. Nothing to see here. Fantastic. So it is a box within a box. It's not really staying. I think they got a little bit cheap with the design on this one. But it's a cardboard box as a cardboard box. Uh, I think that's awesome. There's a barcode here. I wonder if that barcode is anything. But hey, whatever. And you got the Metal Gear Solid exclamation mark. But, all right. So. This is uh, the shirt, guys. Uh, I'll probably stand up a little bit for you. This is the uh, t-shirt. If you see it, it is link and then blue crate. I'm peel that off. All right, but that will conclude this episode. Thank you all for watching. And if you like this video, please uh, share it with a monkey. Be like, hey, yo, monkey. 
Stratalist put up a loot crate. You should watch that. Maybe you guys should buy a loot crate because I'm not sponsored. But hey, if you put loot crate slash Stratalist, you might get 20% off. That's a lie, by the way. Don't do it. You might get banned or something. I don't fucking know. Don't do that. I'm actually not sponsored. I want to be sponsored so fucking bad, but I don't know how. Okay, so if you put loot crate slash Stratalist, you'll get 20% off. Yeah. All right, but thank you all for watching. Uh, please share it with a monkey and uh, drop a like and subscribe. Peace out, guys.